so we have our brand new authentic pizza oven here but of course we need to cure it yes yeah, so it's there's even though it's dry there's still moisture in the grout and if you heat this up too quickly too fast too hot it, it just makes it doesn't work yeah it, you can cause all kinds of problems just, yeah so you need to slowly over multiple days heating it a little bit hotter each time little fires getting a little bit bigger um, so our goal today is 140 degrees Fahrenheit or 60 degrees Celsius, which so is not very hot. Very hot not at all. very hot. Um, so a very light fire, and we need to maintain that for about five hours. Yeah, so four or five hours, and then tomorrow or the next day or the day after, you have to do it five times. But not five times in a row. Just five times yeah. before you actually do a full fire. So I'm just using tiny little pieces of wood today. Um, because I know <laughs> my problem is, uh, you know, my grandfather always taught me, if one's good, five five's is better. better. <laughs> oh, so, I'm my problem will be building the fire small enough. So um, let's go. Let's go. So we're building this fire. There's a little bit of birch, and then for kindling, we've got some pine, just to tiny little pieces of pine, just to get it going. And then two little pieces of cedar, again, just to kind of, because they, they start really quickly. And then another piece of birch on top. And hopefully this will give us enough to kind of get to 140 degrees Fahrenheit. And we are concerned that we will build it too hot. A butane torch just to get the... 